Primary School Math Olympiad Geometric Challenge 18. Triangles, Circles and Quadrilaterals. This is a challenge for Primary School Math Olympiad for questions related to geometry with mixtures of triangles, circles and quadrilaterals. There are five questions. The challenge is to complete them within 25 minutes. If you can't achieve it the first time, do not be disheartened. With practice, if one works hard and revise this challenge multiple times, one should be able to complete this challenge within 25 minutes. Question 1. The diagram comprises a semicircle with a diameter of 14 cm. Within the semicircle there are two squares. Half of both squares are shaded. Find the area of all the shaded parts. Question 2. The diagram comprises a semicircle with a diameter of 14 cm. Within the semicircle there are two equal size rectangles. Half of both rectangles are shaded. Find the area of all the shaded parts. Pi equals 22 over 7. Question 3. The diagram comprises five circles with a radius of 7 cm. Find the length of the elastic band which encircles them. Question 4. The diagram has five quarter circles. The square grids comprise 1 cm squared, square, thus it has 6 by 6 of 1 cm squared, square. Find the area within the arc of the five quarter circles. Take pi equals 22 over 7. Question 5. The diagram comprises a quarter circle with radius of 7 cm. Within the quarter circle is a rectangle. Half of the rectangle is shaded. Find the area of all the shaded parts. Pi equals 22 over 7. Answer for question 1. Shift the shaded part of the squares as shown on the diagram. The two shifted shaded areas form a right angle triangle. The right angle triangle combined with the not shifted shaded areas create a quarter circle with radius equals 7 cm. Thus the area of all shaded parts equals area of the quarter circle, which is 7 times 7 times a quarter times pi. The answer is 38 and a half centimeters squared. Answer for question 2. Shift the shaded part of the rectangles as shown on the diagram. The shifted shaded part combined with a not shifted shaded area to form a partial circle with an arc degrees of 180, minus 30, minus 30, equals 120 degrees. As such the shaded part equals area of the partial circle with arc degrees of 120. Work out the equation, the answer is 51 and one third centimeters squared. Answer for question 3. Add the dotted red lines to the diagram. Each straight line is 14 cm. They represent the length of the straight lines of the elastic band which is equals 5 times 14 equals 70 cm. Add the dotted blue lines and the degree the lines fall with the arc. The total length of the arc lines equals 2 arc with 90 degrees plus 1 arc with 120 degrees. Work out the equation. You have 36 and 2 third centimeters. Thus length of elastic band equals 70 plus 36 and 2 third. The answer is 106 and 2 third centimeters. Answer for question 4. For ease of calculation, break the area to be calculated into two parts. Part 1 equals 36 minus shaded area A, B and C. Work out the equation, you have part 1 equals 3 and 3 over 14. Part 2 equals 9 minus area R, S, T, U, V. Work out the equation, you have part 2 equals 2. Part 1 plus part 2 equals 3 and 3 over 14 plus 2. 
The answer is 5 and 3 over 14 centimeters squared. Answer for question 5. Shift the shaded part of the rectangles as shown on the diagram. The shifted shaded part, combined with the not shifted shaded part, to form a partial circle of 30 degrees, with radius of 7 centimeters. Thus shaded part equals area of the partial circle of 30 degrees. Work out the equation. The answer is 12 and 5 over 6 centimeters squared. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.